And that other dude that she off. Okay, he can compliment her. He can buy her stuff. But he's off her because she wants to fuck him. You know, that's the difference. Are you ready for LFA? Alright guys, now I shouldn't have to make this video, but I do. Now a lot of the guys that come to me for advice and a lot of the people in my comment section, a lot of the viewers out there in the whole entire YouTube manosphere, a lot of you guys watch these kind of videos because you're basically, without knowing it, you're falling into the simp category and you want to get out of that. So I'm going to explain how you can do that. First of all, let's explain what a simp is, how a simp becomes a simp, you know, and then we'll get to how we can get out of it later. So anyways, it all starts with female validation. Now, <clears throat> if uh, now validating a woman in and of itself is not necessarily a bad thing. You know, when I was a kid, my mom used to fall to the floor in the kitchen, bawling her eyes out about absolutely nothing. And my dad would have to validate the fuck out of her to make her feel better and get her back to normal. You know, she's a woman. They do stuff like that. So validation can be a useful tool in some situations. But when it becomes a bad thing is when you're building the foundation of your relationship upon you validating her. Let me give you an example. Let's say you meet a woman and you start out with a compliment. You say, you know, it can be any compliment. You can say, your hair looks beautiful. Okay. Now, that compliment in and of itself is not a bad thing, you know, but if she has a genuine desire for you and she wants you and the two of you start a relationship and, you know, you have a good sex life, um, she has strong emotions for you, you've bonded, you have a, a good relationship, then, you know, your compliments aren't simping. You know, when you validate her, when you buy her stuff, it's not simping, you know. You're just being a good boyfriend, you know, a good man to his woman. And that's perfectly fine. That's your prerogative. <clears throat> but it becomes a bad thing when the whole foundation of your relationship is built upon the validation. And this is where a lot of guys go wrong and they don't even realize it. Men will go years in a relationship where the foundation is just them simping and validating her, you know. Like I said, it can be compliments which give women ego boosts. You can be buying her stuff. You could be providing a lifestyle for her. You know, there's all sorts of different things, but a lot of women will ride that wave for a long time when there's actually no genuine desire there whatsoever. She doesn't lust for that man. She's, she has no emotions for that man. But she's just riding that wave of free stuff, free attention, and, you know, an improved lifestyle maybe. So, <clears throat> a lot of guys kind of fall into this category unknowingly. And then they're just blindsided when she goes and fucks somebody else. Because, you know, they just didn't see it coming. They put all this time, all this effort. They think, oh, I'm such a good guy. I did so much for her. And then she goes and fucks somebody else. But what they don't realize is the whole entire foundation of that relationship was you being a nice guy, okay? Was you buying her shit, was you complimenting her. And that other dude that she fucked, okay, he can compliment her, he can buy her stuff, but he's fucking her because she wants to fuck him. You know, that's the difference. So he's not simping, okay? <laughs> he's doing whatever that's his prerogative you know if he wants to buy her shit if he wants to compliment her if he wants to validate her that's his prerogative but what you're doing is simping because that's not the foundation of his relationship the foundation of his relationship with her was that lust you know she wanted to go over there and get some dick so if he buys her stuff you know whatever that's his prerogative but the foundation of your relationship was you simping and that's when it becomes a problem now, what you need to do, and there's a lot of guys out there, and don't act like, you know, 90% of you guys out there didn't fall in this category at one point. You found this style of content because something happened. You know, your life got flipped upside down. You got your heart broke, you know. Maybe you got tired of women going and fucking other guys instead of you. You know, you meet a woman. You're complimenting her. Seems like, oh damn, like 
like I think she really likes me and then she goes and fucks somebody else okay why because the foundation of your relationship was you validating her and there was no genuine desire the foundation of the relationship needs to be genuine desire so if you're in this category currently or if you've previously been in this category but you didn't quite understand what you need to do is immediately stop validating women and like I said I'm not saying validating women is a bad thing but if you want to find out if a woman is actually in it for the long haul you gotta make her suffer a little bit okay so you can't validate her no compliments no buying her shit you know and if she sticks around okay then it's okay to compliment her it's okay to validate her it's okay to buy her something because the foundation of your relationship is actually genuine she actually wants you you know <clears throat> but if she leaves what you gotta understand is she viewed you as a simp she thought she could ride that wave you know you could buy her some stuff you could give her that ego boost you could make her feel good and she thought you would just keep doing it and then she could heartlessly break your heart <laughs> with no problem because you know a lot of women are savages man it's just the truth they are they'll do it they will do that in a heartbeat without thinking twice about it and they will not give a flying fuck when you're standing over there bawling your eyes out giving her a sad look she won't care okay because she's already getting what she wants from another guy she cares about him not you you know in that situation so anyways to avoid being in that sort of a category because that should be the goal I don't want you whining and bitching and crying and getting all emotional right now no snap out of that the goal is to never be in that category so when you meet a woman don't validate her okay don't buy her stuff well you can a little bit you know if that's your prerogative that's what you want to do you can a little bit but just a little bit and then take it all away just test her just a little bit just test her treat her poorly just a little bit you know don't buy her stuff don't compliment her you know go hang out with your boys go do something fun push her off to the side you know and if she's in it for the long haul you'll know at that point if she leaves let her go you know but th the last thing you want to do is build the foundation of your relationship on validation because that is when you're officially a simp and I'm not even gonna get into only fans and premium snapchats and all that stuff because that is next level simping and guys if that's where you're at get your head out of your ass like we're not even gonna go there like I'm not gonna be nice to you at all about that I'm, I'm just get your fucking head out of your ass and quit that shit okay <laughs> that, that should never happen all right so remember validation is okay if that's not the foundation of your relationship okay if the foundation of your relationship is that she wants you and she wants to be with you and you want to be with her then you've got a good foundation if the foundation of your relationship is you doing things for her you're a simp and that's when you need to break that cycle okay Break the cycle by stopping the simping. Make her suffer a little bit. Stop buying her stuff. Stop complimenting her. Stop doing whatever it is that you're doing that is, you know, some form of simpery. And if she sticks around, then it's okay to validate her again. Maybe, maybe it's okay. You know, if that's the kind of guy you are. But if she leaves, let her go. Let her go. And the next woman you get with, be aware that it's very possible that she's viewing you as a potential simp, a beta bucks, a nice guy, you know, and just be aware and don't let it happen. LFA signing out.